Hello, my name is Daniel Whipple, and I want to be an MMA fighter. <laughs> well, ever since I can remember, I haven't really been an athletically inclined person. I've always felt safety in numbers. Numbers are a safe place. Numbers never hurt. Numbers never backstab. Numbers never tease. People in situations, they can hurt and they can tease, more so the people and the situations. Oh, hello. So uh, let me show you around. I'll start with this. This is uh, the safe where I keep my most prized possessions. Um, my first budget sheet I ever balanced is in there. All of my tax forms uh, throughout the years I have kept in there. Uh, not for fear of auditing. There's a separate safe for that. There's also a memo from work that states, uh, attention, uh, everyone. The vending machines will now be selling and dispensing diet drinks. Doesn't sound like a big deal, but the diet drinks were my idea. So, uh, all in there. Oh, and then this is my trusty briefcase, which I leave right there. And it's got my papers in it. Sometimes I'll put in a, a nougat bar, all sorts of good stuff in there. This is Bernard. He was my very first calculator and he's lasted me a good number of years, been a very trusty friend to me. There you go, Bernard, back where you belong. This is my world map. I make it a point to once a week uh, every Saturday try to memorize all of the countries in a different region of the world. Hey. Hey, Whip. Oh, Did you hey. talk to the Smith account yet? Oh yes, I've been talking all day. Also, I've been going over the budget, which I know isn't technically my job, but mm -hmm. I like to double check everything. Also, I don't think we should have a secret Santa this year. Last year, there were some problems. The secretary's gonna get really upset. They've already started planning it. Yes, well, every year I receive a coffee mug and I can't fit any more on my desk, and it's become kind of a safety, almost a fire hazard. I can't, I can't find time to organize them. So it's just a thought. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Okay, thank you. Great work. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Okay. This is where the magic happens. So this is where um, I normally have all my work, all my files. I have uh, finished ledgers, um, unfinished. Over here we have 401k information. That's my favorite. It's where it happens. This is my hub. This is my town. Mm. Uh, also, if you could, try not to touch anything because Everything's where it should be, and if you were to move it, it would set me back several minutes. Oh my gosh, we are so excited at the office. We have been giving him time to go practice. He's gonna go out there, he's gonna kick some butt and take some names, aren't you, buddy? Oh, I'm taking some names. You got this. He's gonna win, we're all gonna be there. Office holiday. Well, I wouldn't do it myself, but we'll be there to support him. We'll see, buddy. Yeah, we'll see. I'm not gonna be there myself. I got a family parade to go to. Uh, so I'm, I'm not gonna be there, but good luck. Get him whipped, kick his butt, his ass, whatever, just do it. MMA fighting is everything I'm not. It's the fighting, it's brute force, but it's also um, a very disciplined mindset. I would really like to give it a try to see if I can better myself in that area of life. I've studied closely the movements. I've also seen every Ninja Turtles film. I don't know if that's applicable, but I, I, I have mastered a backflip. I lied, I've seen two of the Ninja Turtles films and I cannot do a backflip. Well, I have a friend, his name is Greg, and he does, um, for his business, it is charities. He does all sort like 
uh, galas and dinners to raise money for all sorts of horrendous things like um, Haiti and um, cancer. I do everything on Skype. So I don't have to, I only have to get dressed up from here up. You ready? Okay. Just a second. Okay. B business right. on top, party right. down we'll, below. We'll so, what? What so, was the question again? Why did I help Whip? Uh, why did I do this for Whip? Good question. With a name like Whip, a kid like that should not be in the ring. Should not not be in the ring. Whip is one of those kids that you just look at him and you say, that kid's a star. With a name like Whip, He's gonna go places. This kid, that name, belongs in a ring. You know, we're gonna say, whip. He's gonna whip everybody's ass. He's gonna whip it up, whip straight, go forward, move ahead, try to detect it. It's not too late. Whip it, whip it good. Because he is the man with an attitude like that, the charisma, with the smile, he is a star. Not an athletic bone in his body, but that's not gonna stop him because whip's a star. Hey, 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 look who it is. This is Whip, the Whip Man, the Whip Maestro. Look yeah. at this guy, oh, yeah. He's still good, look okay. at him. Strong like an ox. And look at this guy, look at that. yeah. Go forward, move ahead, try to really? detect it. Move. It's not too late to whip it. Hey, hey, give him that chant we do. Right. Whip, 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 whip him up, whip, 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 whip. whip, whip. whip. I'm, I'm very excited. Oh, I've, been, yeah. I've been keeping myself regular. Lots of Metamucil. Hey, he's a good kid. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. Good, good. I don't have cancer, by the way. He He's just a friend, so that's why he did this for me. <laughs> ah, my first day of training. It's exciting. Sleep in the robe and the glasses. Saves time. Don't wanna be, don't wanna be late. Hello. Hello. Hi. You must be Dan. Yeah, you can, um, you can call me Whip. Oh, can I? Yeah. Yeah. This guy. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm looking forward to working with you. The there... cage is an octagon. It has eight sides. You got your gear? Yeah. Hi. All right. Well, there's the changing room. I'll just meet you out here in five minutes. Oh, yeah. Okay, Web. Right here. We'll start off with just some warm-ups. You can drop your gear right here in the corner by the restroom there. Have you ever done jumping jack before? I, I did once in an elementary gym, but I got a note signed from my grandpa saying that I didn't have to do them again. Seven, eight, I like your ambition. Nine, uh, uh, 10, 11, 12, eight, nine, 10, and then reverse. Yeah, One, I'm left-handed, so two. I... I'm not good, you know. So we have a south paw, that's really good. Careful. 20. All right. Oh, oh, oh Bistrook. Oh, Bistrook, that hurts. Pull your head down to your knee and try to keep your knees You can straight. always see something in students and uh, just with the warm ups, I could tell he was pretty passionate about what he was trying to do. Kind of do the same thing on the other side. So I figured we could probably work with that somehow and maybe try to guide it. When I was in elementary school, I was in the science fair and I wanted to prove that I could withstand being hit on the head with a hammer. But I, I thought that it might, I thought that it might, oh, I thought that it was going to damage my, damage my neck. So I injected myself with the plastic they put inside Stretch Armstrong dolls. I was in the hospital for four months and I ended up not winning. Are we done? Oh, yeah, I, I didn't win the science fair, but I like to think that I was taught an important life lesson. Hmm. Okay, let's go. This is your fourth water break today. I have to build up a surplus of inside water so I have more to, more to use. Hydration is important. We're burning daylight. Come on, let's go. 
Uh, let's start off with a fighting stance. Do you know a basic fighting stance? You know, it took a... Uh, yeah, close. Usually it, we go a little quicker with other students, so it took a little bit longer for you want that for whip to, to kind of get that. into even training. There you go. You want to get that weight right behind your punch. If, like, if if I'm looking that way, should the should should it follow my face? Oh, you want to look straight ahead. Okay, let's see if you can hit my hand here. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> can I go get some more water? I, I'm, I'm dehydrating. I'm. It's all right. Let's just uh, let's work on this a little bit, and then we'll do the other side, and then then we talk about a water break. Unleash the tiger. There you go. Okay, whip. Let's see. Uh, wait, let's see. Wait, let's see what you got. Move the hip out. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let me introduce you to your sparring sparring partner, Natalie. Wow. My name's Natalie, and uh, Tao called me. He needed uh, me to get I, Dan Whipple I, ready for I, an I, MMA fight. Your name is Natalie. Why? Why does your mouth guard say Ariane? It was my last opponent's. I liked hers better. It's unsanitary. Get warmed up. Okay, we're just gonna do a little light sparring. Okay, nothing too crazy. Take it easy on the new guy. All right, begin. All right, sparring. Ready? Can I get? Can I get it? No. <coughs> you okay? I'm. Gonna get some water, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna use the bathroom. Are you all right, Whip? Whip. Him. Natalie just threw one punch, and he quit. I've never seen that before. I don't think. I mean, it's a little rough around the edges. Uh, took like nine. 19 water breaks. I thought he was a little awkward. He wasn't really familiar with his body, but he's doing really well. And uh, he definitely knows how to hydrate. My partner who's been helping me train, Natalie, she, as a person, I think she's swell, but I definitely watch for her when walking to my car and entering my home. Relationship with Guinea overall is, um, she's she's a very very good very good um, better half for me. She used to work in the same building I do. She used to work in accounts payable. She mm -hmm. actually was the manager. I was the of, manager of the overall branch. Mm -hmm. I was sitting in the break room one day because every day he sat there every every day. I would sit there every day mm -hmm. except of course the days I don't work in which case the building is locked. I would always forget my lunch. I would make a lunch and then leave it on the table at home. <laughs> every day. Every day. I think if our relationship oh, yes. was like a then, line yes. graph, then it would be a gradual slope upward without many uh, crests or troughs, just a steady ramp. The first thing she ever asked me was if I was DTHH. <laughs> and I I had to look up what that meant. And once I found out, I told her, remember, I told her I'm I'm DTHH B T N T R M, which is um <laughs> I'm down to hold hands but try not to rush me ten letters up. <laughs> um every Thursday night is uh, date night for Guinea and I and we go out and uh, do couples activities. And today, we're going to do um, a picnic because we have a Tupperware container and we pull activities out. But the picnic one had miniature golf stuck to it as well. And so since I drew it out, um, we have to do both. Oh, there's a bicycle. It's very excellent for cardio. Ah, this is a good picnic -y spot. That guy might be dead. I don't, I don't, uh, I don't know. How's training been going? Training is going well. I've learned to successfully take um, a punch. Did you make this? I actually purchased it from a local convenience store. <laughs> Certain parts of this park need to be watered over there. And over there. We could we could do that on another date. Yeah, just 
bring some buckets or possibly a squirt gun. I have two watering cans at my house. So we've been, you know, dating three years tonight and I, I was thinking that maybe, uh, maybe tonight we could like snuggle. I mean like, if you think that's cool. I don't want to push you. It's, it's up to you. We'll take things as slow or as fast as you want. Oh, well, that's definitely something to be um, considered. Yes. They both end with the mummy. So. Oh, they do? OK. It was cool they knew your name inside. Did they? Oh, yes, yeah. yes, it was. That's good. Lots of people here tonight, it's mm -hmm. kind of. Your bag is really cool. Oh, thank you, thank you. This is the bag I, this is the bag I wore to high school. Really? Yeah. That's I, really cool that you keep things for so long. Well, it, 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 it's a lot cheaper, more fiscally responsible than purchasing a new one at the beginning of each school year. We could just do the mummy right now. I don't know why. I can already see that they didn't separate any recycling, so it's probably all going to go straight to the garbage, but mm -hmm. it's important not to have litter. You want to see my impression of a, um, a goat? Yeah. Yeah? Uh! Nice. Uh, according to a recent study, it's the uh, uh, 75th most popular sport in the world. Wow. Yes, yeah, so I would estimate around maybe uh, uh, 35 million people annually miniature golf. Is this, is this right? Mm -hmm. Okay. <gasps> oh. Okay. Um, I'll get out of your way. Okay. Okay. Go whip! Yay! But it's, it's there in it's thought. The thought. It's okay. Thought. All right. <gasps> what? Oh wow! Holy cow! Oh wow! Okay. It is kind of cool that there's an actual frog here. Yeah, it is. <gasps> Shoot! Sometimes she can get a little um overzealous with the whole um romance thing. I've told her several times my limits. My limits are low for now. I've been hurt before. That's not true, but. I've seen people be hurt, and I gotta tell you, it doesn't look doesn't look pleasant. So, I don't want to move too fast because if you're not moving very fast, then when things come come to a screeching halt, there's not that much of a of a collision. So, slow collision is better than than fast collision, as cars show you. My um. Grandfather, he is overall very supportive. He has been of, he's been a big supporter of mine for my entire life, basically. I'm Harold Whipple. I'm patriarch of this family, such as it is. I am Evanine Whipple, and I was Dan Whipple's wife. That would be Whip's stepmother, actually, not his mother. I'm Roy Tucker. Uh, Lord Ogderen is that's the name I, I go by, and this is uh, Melissa, my wife. I'm Melissa Whipple Tucker. My stepbrother, Devin, um, we've never really gotten along. He's, uh, he was sort of adopted into the family. Does that make him my stepbrother? I really need to use the bathroom. Yeah, well, train with me. I don't have like, Just hit time. me, come on! Hit me. <laughs> That's adorable. Go, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Ellen loves you. Damn it. So I wouldn't call him a supporter, but I would definitely say that he that he helps fuel the drive behind my want. Boy's just uh, kind of helpless. You know how that works, right? Whip, he's got all kinds of, of things going for him, but you know, Devin, he needs me. Sometimes I wonder why he's even here. He'd be a real son if uh, he had my blood in his veins. But even though he's not my blood kin, I might accept him just a little bit more if he'd stay within his race. Uh, online, I was uh, I was trying I was trying to to do a little bit of dating. It wasn't working out so well for me, so I tried that route. It, it wasn't that hard actually. No, you just lie on the questions and you find someone real quick. 
my father is not very nice. So I talk to my mom and my grandmom and my great grandmom and my great aunt and my great great aunt who's very old and very wise and she suggests America. Many movies show like The Notebook and Drive, very good men fight for the woman so I wanted mine. I like the movies. They are cheaper. My favorite actors are Ryan Gosling, Denzel Washington. Uh, the one you look like. I I You look like John Wayne. I look like John Wayne. <laughs> it's not that physical. I'm on the road a lot. I'm you know, I'm used to being alone. No roundabouts. Where'd you get this tattoo? It's not a tattoo. I went it's a stamp. It it's a stamp. I went I went to a club earlier. Just hang out for a little bit. Not like pick up girls or it's fine. Devin and Urine, um, yeah, absolutely, because it's gotten to the point where when one thinks of Devin, they think of urine. It's like wherever he goes, there's always like the essence of urine with him. And it's, it's a beautiful thing, really. They got t-shirts with each other's faces on them at the at the local fair and so wherever he goes he'll have urine on him it's it's just a beautiful relationship i'm happy that they're proud of each other and that he's just so happy with his urine it's it's a thing of fairy tales really you know what she's still doing here i mean she keeps things in a constant state of uproar these boys, you know, they, they notice her because really she's just a little bit too womanly. She is attractive. Give her that. I mean, that woman, she, she's tricky. It's that Southern Belle attitude she's got that she gets away, she could get away with murder. Of course, that's a sore subject. My um, father met a very untimely end, and the family the family doesn't blame Evanine, but at the same time, she is somewhat responsible for his death. We were married for six months. You wouldn't know that Dan was just quite a romantic soul. He went pretty fast. He was, a, he was, he was kind of hot. Dan had kind of a weak heart. He wasn't really ready for all the woman that I am. She's a very um, buxom individual. Well, you see, we had this one night where he took a little Viagra because he was a little bit of an old man. One evening, while the two of them were copulating. It was great. He had so much endurance. We went for such a long time. It was really, well, anyway, I finished. And he, well, he finished, but it was kind of in a different way. I never was really satisfied with the way my poor departed boy left this world. I suppose that it was just uh, too much all at once for, for Dad, and his heart gave out from, I believe, a mixture of exhaustion and ecstasy. <laughs> We have four, four children. We're both um, really into LARPing. Live uh, action role playing. Right. I'm a warrior. Uh, I played D&D &D since, you know, I could read. I uh, played every MMO there has ever been. I go back to EverQuest. And we've been LARPing together for the past three years, but I am a, you know, a 10 year man before that. There's a thrill in staring down a 200 pound guy in a 200 pound set of armor with nothing but a foam sword and a shield made out of stop sign. She's, mm -hmm. she's a wow girl and that's, you know, it's not nothing. So we were at kind of a big uh, convention and... Um, Pakatani Fair, I think it was. It was. Um, and I, I, I was in character, I was, um, my character is Larissa, she's a thief, and she's a very good thief, actually. 
and I was actually right in the middle of robbing him, and he caught me. Yeah, I came in well, second again at the turkey leg eating, and I was, you know, laid out on a rock somewhere, and she stole my clothes, all of them. And so I, I just chased after him. Where are my clothes, wench? Where? And people are staring and they're laughing and she's running. She, you didn't think I was going to wake up, did you? You looked like you were dead. I work at a lunchbox factory. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Honey, we've talked about this. It's, you can't laugh in front of people when I tell them where I work. It's serious work. Do you want? Do you want? Do you want our children going to school with lunch bags, grease the little? Stop it! Okay. The cheese melts out of the bottom. The whole thing opens before noon. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of stresses, a lot of relationships in this family that just don't quite gel, in my opinion. Well, when I, when I found out he was going to do this, I punched him in the face, and you know what? That didn't go down so well. See if he could take it, and he couldn't. I'm actually, believe it or not, grateful for the punch to the face because I considered it a first step in a, in a sort of training. So thank you. Thank you, Devin, for assisting in my training. It needs to be more supportive. Oh, I'm really exciting. Yeah, it's, there's been so much excitement in the family. I mean, I swear we can hardly stand ourselves. It's just so exciting. Except for him. He, he doesn't... Except for me. Yeah, and, and her, That's I don't think she case. even. Uh, yeah, I don't think she even knows what's going on. Mm -hmm. Bite. Happy. I remember when when I was a young boy, he wanted to help manly me and Devin up, so he took us on a camping trip and left us there. He said that <laughs> the best way to become a man is to survive the elements. Yeah, how long it was it before they sent the rescue parties? I don't. I'm trying to they remember. Sent, they sent the rescue party after two weeks. Grandpa forgot where in the woods he dropped us off, and when they found us, Devin had me against a tree. He wanted to cut me open to get in me for warmth, and I did my best to fend him off with a stick. Yeah. And it was it was a it was a learning experience. Yes, yeah, so, yeah Whip's so. very good with a stick. I'm talking about a stick. There's nothing wrong with a stick. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I I was fine. He just kept freaking out. He he just he kept walking around. Just was a lot of help. Him just running around, making a bunch of noise. You know, for what it's worth, for what it's worth, in the two weeks we were in the forest, we saw 493 quaking aspens, 237 pine trees, and we took 7,263 steps. There you go. There you go. Yeah. So helpful. Um, in ancient uh, Taiwan, they use sticks for chopsticks. That's true, they do. So, um, right now in the training process, I'm, okay, so it's like, here's, here's success and here's, um, failure. I'm throwing it right down the middle. We work out together. We work out together three times a day. Every morning we get up at five o'clock and we do 13 and a half push-ups. That additional three and a half is the most I can do. We really push him. And there was actually um, an exercise that Natalie taught me that builds up your resistance to punches to the face. 15, 17, 18, 19, 20. I'm very sore. I have a hard time moving. 22. Answer back. 22. What have I been telling you? Hands, hands up. Okay. No, hands up. Answer back. Using hands the up. bathroom has become even more of a chore than okay. normal. Okay. Right. You want to do it again? Yeah. But I feel myself. I feel strength. I feel there's some, there's definitely strength there that wasn't present before. Oh yes, he's so, he's so much stronger now in his muscles. Okay, mm -hmm. good. Yes. Climbing a little high up the arm. And he's com sorry. confident. Sometimes he takes his glasses off now. It's only when I have to clean them. Oh good, all right. Devin's um, attitude has remained practically <clears throat> the same since he first 
joined our family. Just hit me, come on! I've grown to not expect much else from him, but- Since I've joined the family, I was here well, first. That's not called for, Devin. We still love you. You're great. I, I love you. Thank you, Yura. Now, who names what? their child after a bodily function? I think that's just not very nice. Your well, parents weren't very nice no, for that. No, it's not a bodily function. Do you understand oh, anything I'm saying? It's creative. Honey? It means morning blossom. Not, I knew that. I tell you, that's a match made in hell right there. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Very good, Yura. Well, I, my brother's a great guy. Um, he's really sweet. Um, he actually helps us make some of our LARPing costumes. He's really handy with needle and thread. <laughs> if he was going to choose a weapon, that would, that would be the weapon of choice. A needle. But I never really saw Whip as a fighter. Um, my advice is to just remember who you are. Absolutely, absolutely. Those other guys are gonna know what whip means when they meet him, that's, that's for sure. Whipping the opposition. That's the support of which I was talking about earlier. Thank you, thank you, Grandpa. He's gonna go down. There is nothing I can say to help him. I think that when those gentlemen strip down to their tiny little shorts to do fight, he's gonna show them that he can do some pretty manly things. <laughs> Thank you, Evelyn. Just say in Chinese. You go down, and then you hit them on the face with the I actually I went to school with him before I met her, and uh, there was a group of bullies, and he got caught in the place, the wrong place, at the wrong time, and uh, you know they beat him, they they punched him. Once he was down, they they dragged him around school, just by the foot, and that was like second period, and they they dragged him around all day. They dragged him out to the bus, um, and. While he was going, he was counting, I think it was meters? He was talking about some sort of empirical system of measurement, and he was counting them as he was going. He did say something about the lockers. I think he was counting the lockers. As he went, he by. went by, yeah. That was, it was, he was, as he was going by. And he seemed perfectly okay with it, which is why he's going to get beat. And he's going to be the garbage cans too. He counted the garbage cans, and then for some reason, when he got him onto the bus, he was doing like division with the number of lockers per garbage cans. He didn't even know he was the loser of a fight anymore. He was doing math. That's when we knew that Whip was good at math. Our neighbor had chickens, and he loved the chickens. Well, the chickens, they chase him around the yard, and then they just, they do the little flappy thing, just like in Zelda, but, and he runs, he runs away. Right, but he In little that. circles, mm -hmm. and it's not gonna go well in the ring. Maybe Whip needs to reinvent himself. Maybe he needs to man up. Would like to see that. I just don't want to see him get hurt. Just no hydrating.
Montana, Montana. <laughs> Jorge has been my good friend for a number of years now, uh, ever since ever since I can remember. And uh, a few years ago, he went through kind of a he went through an interesting phase, uh, a goth phase, if you will. Remember, he was over um, at my place one evening, and then out of nowhere, he turned to me and said, uh, "Death is the only life." And I'm not gonna lie, it ruined Transformers Marathon Night and everyone had to go home early. I've still stayed in contact with him, we're still very good friends, but sometimes he does still uh, hang around with his old group of gothic friends. What? Oh, um, you might wanna take your glasses off. They're a painful reminder that mankind is flawed. Take, take them off for the best. The people we're gonna party with aren't gonna like it. Oh, okay, that's under. This is gonna be, this is gonna be some really good party. Oh, I'm so excited. So happy. I felt, I felt you're a prize fighter. You're, whoa. You're a prize fighter, my friend. And uh, you deserve a prize party. Excited too. I'm excited to always meet new friends, meet new people. So, um, um I don't know any of, of, of uh, your friends. Oh, yeah. So I invited my friends. Um, cause your company won't let me back in the building. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, um, I don't blame them. Just you have to pay for the vending machine. So. I feel, yeah, it, so I invited my, my friends. They're, they're still my friends. Anyways, you. Is this the right party? Yeah, this, like, this oh, is the okay. right party. It is, yeah. I'm Meet excited. these new people. I'm excited. Okay, so uh, I, I guess you can introduce me to everyone. Yeah, yeah. More people than you do. Yes, okay. So, hi. Hello, hello. Do you like death? And puppies? Ooh, death and puppies are perfect. I have to use the bathroom. No, 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 no. no. Oh. There's no bathroom in this house yet. I like puppies a lot. I had a puppy once, but it, it ran away. My neighbor has it. So Beautiful. It's this saddening. Is, this is Whip. He's going to kill another man. No, no, no. And he's no, going I'm to not. release his soul no. into the eternal aura. No, I'm well, not. Go. There's no releasing of any souls. Okay. This, is, this is Whip. We're having the party for him. Hi, I'm Jacob. Hello. This My is Jacob. Dan. Dan. Do you? Me. Let me. Let me ask you. Do you like uh, poetry? Yes. No, 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 not, not, not poetry. I'm talking poetry. Poetry. Have you ever stared darkness right in the face and asked it to welcome you? Poetry. Poetry. The, I, I, I like poetry. Dark, like. Yes. You know, just messes with your. It makes you your know, soul. I've feel. always, I've always liked I, I, to think that I saw it on Mulberry Street. <laughs> no. Are you sure there's no bathroom? No. I'm pretty. Okay. And uh, this is this is the man that introduced me into the goth culture. Hello, N nice, nice to meet you. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, you were gonna kill a man. Uh, no, no, he, he's he's exaggerating just a little bit. I, I I'm, um. <sighs> You'll do it. You want some licorice? I know you like licorice. I do like licorice. Let's go get some licorice. licorice. I have licorice. I know. So, pretty good party, yeah? Uh -huh. hey, what? What? They, um, uh, they, they want to do a poetry slam. You, you're a poet, right? You're, 
You're autistic. Do you want to do a poem? Uh, will you help me? Thank you all for coming to the Poetry Slam. I'm Jacob. And I'm Bryson. And we're Satan Sack. And we each have a single poem and then a masterpiece for you. My soul is full of darkness, as full as my mom's smart car is when she gets in it. I don't have so much of a, a poem as much of a sad story. On the car ride here, I ran over a small cat and was telling my friend. Lucky cat. Yeah, lucky cat, that's what I thought. And as I, as I hit the cat and I stopped for a moment, I thought, why couldn't the cat be driving? And now for a masterpiece. This masterpiece is entitled Lucifer's Not a Conformist. Knock, knock. Who's there? Lucifer. Hi, Lucifer. Come on inside. I smell darkness. Is there darkness? Only inside. I remember we were gonna we practiced that at home. Sorry. We were gonna plot it at the same time. The death of my cute puppy oh, no. has brought much fear and sadness. And the more I think about it, it brings me to madness. So today, my blacks didn't match. Mm -hmm. They. One was darker than the other, and I just, and then I did my eyeliner and I was out. I had no eyeliner. As you all know, I recently had a loss. Mm -hmm. Yes. And she is not here with us today. Mm -hmm. She's lucky. Yeah. So this one's for her. Demons ride the night sky above the stars. And the stars shine down, but can't break the cover to you. Your cool skin is pale and beautiful. Your makeup has grown old and is smeared. Mm -hmm. Get out of bed, the oatmeal's ready. We had it more. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Um, life is bad, but l life is sad, but d death is coming, and that makes me glad. Thank you. 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 I wonder how long total it would have taken to put on all of the mascara. I'll have to go home and crunch some numbers. Now, is that hour and a half round trip total or hour and a half up, hour and a half down? Good. Um, well, it, it depends on, on uh, how fast you sprint. Stay on the trail, that'll probably be easier on, oh, okay. on your ankles and stuff. Sorry. The Keep an eye out for rocks, all right? Yeah. Keep up. Or we'll never make it in an hour and a half. We'll make it like four. Yeah. Hour 27. Right, 
was better than Kirk, but the overall show was of much better quality. So, uh... I didn't... I didn't ever ask you why you got... Why you got into cage fighting. Why, you, why that was so important to you. MMA is more than... MMA fighting is the very antithesis of what I am. And I wanted to see if I could push myself farther away from me. Leave the me zone and go towards other zones. I dabble. It's like a school field trip. Only less educational and more self-empowering. I think you'll find, uh, I think you'll find when you get in the cage that, that you're not really fighting the other person, you're fighting yourself. You're your own worst enemy. So the other opponent is like not gonna hit me? Oh, they're, they're gonna hit you, but it's more, um, it's when you step into that cage, that, that takes courage. Oh, this You're is You're fighting for yourself. Yes, exactly. I should have known that. I'm sorry. Okay, ready to go? I'm king of the world, if that's okay with all of you. Right. Welcome to the official weigh-in for Dan Whipple. Would you please step on the scale? One hundred and ninety-nine pounds. Huh. All right. Woo! Good job. You made it. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What needs to carbo load for tomorrow? So I'm making spaghetti because I saw on Pinterest that that is the best way to carbo load. Whew. You gotta turn it down a little bit. Oh, and in general, he needs to be like, like those Italian stallions. And this is an Italian dish, spaghetti. I sort of feel like a TV star. You know, you can help. Side of the table. I think that you'll like this. It's long and, and a little bit wide. Yeah, then we can just put the bread on the table. I'll uh, we'll put yeah. this right here between the two That's of okay. us. Hi! Wow. Hey, Dad. Oh, cool. um, wow. I, where, um, how about you? Just sit right here, there? Here, here, next to me. Yes, okay. next to me. Here. Dad, are you, are you excited? Getting closer, uh, nerves, uh, a little bit of butterflies in the stomach, but sure. I'm um, fairly confident in my abilities. Still time to, you know, not do it. That's what that's what people keep telling me. There, there's a Magic the Gathering uh, convention going on. We could always go, go to that. Lots of stuff to count. What are we talking about? Uh, well, he, they were just, just asking how he's feeling. Oh, great, mm -hmm. Devin. I believe it's your turn to say grace. All right. Oh, God. Come on, be nice. Say something nice for your brother. Good God. Okay, let's see. Well, uh, Hermione, Galadriel, and uh, Hal are all at magic camp. Mm. Oh. Um, Lando is 
not. I don't want to talk about that. We, we, we don't want to talk about Orlando. Will they do a magic show for us? Next oh, no, like Magic the Gathering, like the card game? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Aren't yeah. yeah. they a little bit young? No, it's fine. I'll, I'll show her. I'll show but her. maybe we should just tell them where he is, uh, just so that they know. I'll give you some. Yeah. No, no, I definitely. No. I, that's very creative. I never would have thought to do that. Yeah. Uh, do you have any sticks or something? Yeah, yeah in the it's your own yeah. fault. Oh, um, do you, want, do you want to use my spoon? D don't we have any chopsticks? Oh, yeah, we had another meltdown at number two today. Oh, will you pass the bread? Timmy was trying to, mm -hmm. he's the new guy who's working on the, the mm -hmm. vacuum form machine. <laughs> You can't make a thermos without the vacuum. I, I know, you told me that, yeah. I'm sorry. Do it, but it's pretty close. So the, you put that on and it pops off. Oh, I'm so sorry. And it goes into the vat. Would you like some oh, bread? Timmy. Yeah, you know, you're reaching mm -hmm. out. I know I'm on the edge that idea. Yeah, Timmy doesn't need that. It's very nice sorry. bread. Sorry, it's not funny, but he's swirling around. It's funny. Yeah. I did so not lunch box. boxes so were such box. a dangerous line of work. We lose 10 people a year. Only like two or three of them die. We just can't find the other ones. Yeah, well, I think Thanks, that a fantasy camp might do you some real good. I went to girls I know camp. a lot about fantasy. We learned a lot of really fun songs. I, I once went fun. to a Boy yeah. Scout camp. I wasn't a Boy Scout or invited. Randall's at football camp. <gasps> oh, fun. It was, do you remember oh, Alfonso from high school? Oh, yeah. That guy up. Yeah, well, he, he's he been teaching my son a sport. So yes, he's at Pee Wee camp and... And that's all we're gonna say about it. It's really popular. I told him I was gonna love him no matter what he did and I, one day I'm gonna tell him that we I We tell the same thing to you. So it's a lot like yeah. being gay then, right? No, we, we, we'd be happy if he was gay. That's not true at all. That's not true at all. Do you eat salad? Oh, I have been. I've asked Greg several times who my opponent will be, and I've yet to get any information back. Greg's a great guy. I, th I think he'll set things up to make them nice and fair, even playing field. And uh, in the end, he'll do me right. I'm, I'm sure of it. I'm going to give Greg a call and uh, find out who my opponent is. Oh, All right. That's a good idea. We, we don't know who your opponent is? Uh, hello, Greg? Uh, hello, who's this? Uh, this is Dan. Huh? How are you doing? Oh, Whip? Yeah, Whip? yeah, yeah. Whip, yeah, Whip. Oh, I, I was just wondering who my opponent was going to be in the, uh, in the match. I'm I'm the whip man. No, 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 no. You say I'm the whip man. Hi, I'm the whip man. You are the man. You are the whip man. And whip man bows down to nobody. All right, whip. Does that sound good to me? Okay, good. All right. Uh, I gotta get going. Uh, I, I gotta I gotta massage in just a couple of minutes here. I was just wondering if we could get like just like a name of the opponent or any. All you gotta know is that you're the man. Say I'm the whip man. I'm. I'm the whip man. Yes, you are. Okay, very good. All right. I'll talk to you later, baby. Okay? See ya. Bye. Yeah, I, I'm going to... Oh, okay. I'm going to be... That um, wasn't helpful. You're the whip man. You're the whip man. I'm the whip man. Yes, you're the whip man. As I've stated. Yeah. You're going down. He's going to be... A, you're going to be just fine. Thank you. Yeah. We don't want to have huh. Hey, whip. Good luck in the fight. You whip it to them good, man. Thank you. I have an announcement. I've been working on this for two weeks. Therefore, when you go in the ring. Oh. Yeah. That, those are charming. Get to have a sparkly pee on the dead center of my bum. Everyone, I, I, I have an announcement too. Uh, urine's gonna be the ring girl. Oh. Uh, oh, I, I, I don't think that means what she thinks it means. It's gonna be yeah. fine. I stitched it on. Yeah. Is that what they call Rick Rack? Well, I found her when in online dating. <laughs> a toast! A toast! To excitement! To Dan! Whip it! Whip it good! Whip, Whip it! it. Hey, Grandpa. Hey, I'm here! 
Hello, hello, um, uh, everyone. This is um, this is Natalie. She's been helping me hi, get ready. Hi, Natalie. How are you? Good. Do you want to talk for a little? Oh. Yeah, yeah. I'll, yeah. I'll be, I'll, I'll be back. Be, be safe. Uh, okay. How are you? Yeah. I'm, I'm good. How are you? Too bad. These are, oh, these are the um, shorts that Guinea made oh, me. Oh, wow. Yeah. I think those she are, did a good job with those. Those are really great. Yeah. So, how are you feeling? Oh, you know, I'm, I'm doing all right. It's kind of... <clears throat> You've got this. you worked really hard. Yeah. What do you do if somebody punches you? You answer back, right? Answer back, yeah. I, I want to thank you, really, for all your help. If, um... Thank you. You're gonna do great. Thank you. Thank you. It's good. really hard. You, you know what you're doing. It means a lot to hear that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Remember what we taught you? Okay, remember what we taught you. Do I get, like, water breaks in between? Four minutes. You can do it. Yeah, okay, you relax. know what you're doing. Remember the punch kick combos? Punch kick. Can, can, can I take the bottle in with me? Where's the other posters? Just one. Just, you only brought the one? It's always gonna last anyway, so that's fine. Move. You got this. Make sure you run around. Keep your hands up. Hands up. Hands and relax. Move around. How's that feel? Feels um, it's a little tight. I don't want my fingers like to lose circulation. Maybe we should, you know, rain check until my fingers feel better. Okay, that's 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 good. 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 Sit down. Sit down. Okay. Oh, I'm excited. Are you excited? Yeah, yeah. I can't wait to see uh, how this ends. Cross. <coughs> Jab. <coughs> Hook. <coughs> Cross. <coughs> Jab, uh, hook, uh, you're doing great. Uh, Cross, uh, jab, uh, hook. Uh, well, we didn't bring the kids. Um, uh, Galadriel, Hermione, and Hal are still at fantasy camp, and Lando is still a. Well, we didn't bring. We didn't bring. Yeah. Pee football. Ooh. We could be front row. Oh my! Look at that. Oh. Yes. Well, oh, this makes me so excited. I haven't been this nervous, you know, <laughs> since I was drafted. You got this. Got this. You got this. You worked got hard. This. Worked hard. You worked hard. Worked hard. You've worked on punch kick combos. You know what to do. I punched a combo. You know what to do. Know what to do. You know what to do. Know what to do. If they punch you, you answer back. Answer back with yes. with another punch. Or right? kick, punch, or kick. kick, or punch kick combo. Right. You can right. throw more than one. I want to see Whip beat somebody. I want to see Whip beat somebody. We like pain. Yeah. yeah. Just a little bit. Daniel Lippo, murder victim. It's okay, live in, live in your dream. Go out there, gonna, gonna punch. Grandpa's got your back. Oh my god, there's front row seats. Yes. Yes. Oh, he's great. Go whip! Go whip! Woo! Woo! I gave him the day off just to come here and get his ass kicked. And I might give him more time off next week to recover. If it's bad enough. And he has a doctor's note. And I'm not shorthanded. I think I have those boots. Oh, yeah. I picked these up. Just, uh, <coughs> oh, oh, that looks great. Isn't that looks real. We thought new, new 
pencil erasers, um, a perfectly balanced ledger. No. Um, One, two, three, five, seven, eleven, thirteen, seventeen, three point one four one five nine eight six seven five three oh nine. We would like to welcome you all out to Absolute MMA, where you can learn mixed martial arts, fighting styles, gain self-confidence, and get in shape. Monthly memberships available for purchase. Just see me, Tao, or Rob after the fight. Now for your main event. <laughs> <laughs> Your first fighter weighing in at 199 pounds, a record of zero wins, zero losses, no fights in his past. He's the man with the name of a champion, Dan the Whip Whipple. Yeah! Challenger, who just arrived a little late, weighing in at 199 pounds, though he obviously doesn't look like he weighs that much. Yes, hello? Can you send an ambulance and two paramedics to 13? Uh, with a record of zero wins, zero losses as well. Here he is, Leander the Punisher Cannon. Yeah! Shut up! Hey, I'm, I'm Leander. I'm really looking forward to my first MMA fight. My friend Greg, he got me this gig. He owns a bunch of charities. Hashtag battered women's charities. Really looking forward to pounding my opponent into the ground. Hashtag love pounded. Better watch out, Dan Whipple, because I'm coming for you. <laughs> Why is that guy jumping around all over the place? I wonder how hard he looks so good there. <laughs> What a nice clean fight, gentlemen. No junk punches. Touch gloves, come out swinging. Get 
ever stared darkness right in the face and asked it to welcome you out? Death is coming, and that makes me glad. Close the door. It's okay. Do you need to take a break? After the fight, I don't really know what happened, but all of a sudden she came out of nowhere. She started hitting me. I don't think so. Not today. I've never really been hit on before. It's kind of nice. We're we, dating. Yeah. We're, we're drunk on love punch. So, hashtag love punches. I rearranged his face the way I like it. I like it too. Here, sweetie. There you go. Well, well, I learned that numbers are not always the best way of coping with stressful times. Numbers failed me during the fight, so I've had to find a new way of distracting myself from the woes of reality, and that is with my newfound friend. Uh, this is Captain Worcestershire. He helps me where numbers fail to help me. He'll always lend an ear, and hopefully will get me through the future stressful times. I think the plan is to get prepared to do it again next year. I mean, up and away. We're so excited. He'll be better, he'll be better next year. Uh, Just more and more awesome. Hey, Whip. America. Let's go.
check one, check two. <laughs> it's creative. I did a term paper once on on uh, on China, and and they name people poo. Online. Yeah. Yeah. What, what drew you to her? She was a girl. I was looking. My eyes. It, yeah, I was. I told her it was her eyes. <laughs> Did you know that paper plates were actually invented as a cheap substitute for ceramic plates? So what do you call that? Pants. <laughs> <laughs> you were not. <laughs> we should do platter. I've been told that before. I don't know if I should try it though. I I have overactive sweat glands, and it's like it's like trying to. Peel the sausage casing off of some salami. It's just... Life is a whirlpool to spare. Life is sad. Life is terrible. I have often cried myself to sleep, but I stopped doing that because it's bad to fall asleep with a soggy pillow. Mildew will form and it's bad for your respiratory system. Sometimes, though, I wake up and I'm halfway through a cry. I have night cries and um, I think it's kind of scaring my cat. Every time I wake up, the cat's over in the corner huddled under my dirty clothes hamper and the fur is matted. So I, I worked out through setting up hidden cameras in my bedroom that I would chase the cat around and use Jinxies to dry my tears, which made me go to the store and purchase some Kleenexes and tissues for to actually wipe them, but I continued to use the cat. I'm not a cat, but if I were, I wouldn't want to be used to wipe tears. <laughs> it's funny, because Whip, he's such a nice kid, you know. You know, you could you could you could you could ask to borrow his car for the weekend. You know, and uh, you could uh, you could be like uh, you know just uh, you could take it out. You could go out to, to to go to the casinos. You know, or or you know uh, take out. I don't go to casinos. You know, when when you're stuck in reality, you know you have to follow a set of rules, and you know A applies, B applies, C applies. But when you LARP, you can be anything. You can Q. do anything. Be Q. You were Q for a couple of months. Yeah. Well, I mean, next generation had just gone off the air, so. Right, it was, it's fine. The hat was. You just, there's just more, more you can do. One evening, while the two of them were um, copulating, he uh, suffocated under the massive weight. <laughs> <laughs> His heart gave out, and when they found him, he was in a very sorry state. Uh, the handcuffs had restricted all blood flow to his hands. They don't believe he was able to signal for her to stop, and he certainly couldn't vocalize it what, with, the, uh, with the ball gag. And <laughs> we found uh, a, a, a Kama Sutra book with three-fourths of the pages checked off a pillow in the shape of a heart. We found a box of condoms that he must have gotten from a specialty store because each one a different color and flavor. I tried a green apple one and it was delightful. I'm not going to lie. We can edit that part out. It's like a rush. It's like in every horror movie, when you're, there's the blonde girl and she falls before she's stabbed, I feel like the blonde girl. Give me action. Yeah. Yeah, I can do some action. Why? How do I say these things? Nobody knows. Okay, I give you a good deal. You'll be here for an hour.
I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. Would you like some bread? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Did you know that they made Gatorade to, for our sports drink exclusively for the sports team, the Gators? That's why it's called Gatorade. They make lots of more flavors than they had. His heart's full of sadness. His heart's full of sadness, yes. Sadness and goldfish. I saw the Eva tank once. It was very, you released their souls, touching. I don't remember that. One time he put in a, a hot pocket for too long and burned his tongue when it came out. I don't think hot pockets have souls. I guess if they did, he would have, he would have freed <laughs> it. We've been working on our cardio quite a bit. Yeah, he's uh, pretty short-winded. I, I can usually last longer. Yeah, I think she could last all day. <laughs> yeah. We we'll also work on our sparring. She did this really awesome thing where she put her leg up behind her head. Dude, it blew my mind. Really choked me out really quick. Yeah, I, I, I like to rear naked choke. Oh uh, yeah, your, your ground and pound game is awesome. Yeah, we love ground and pound. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, we do. I, I really do need to work on my stand-up game though. Yeah, yeah, and also um, your bottom game. I'm, I'm really good at the mount, and uh, yeah, good at, good at mounting and. I, and, I learn uh, I learn a lot when you're game. on top mounting me. My top game's really good. Yeah, but I usually last longer when I'm when I'm on bottom. We can go the full round when I'm on top. I think it can last two minutes usually. So. Yeah, it, it's true. Yeah, it's true. hashtag it's true. You ever stared darkness right in the face and asked it to welcome you? You ever? felt it so far within your own aura that you didn't even know there was that much deepness within you? I'm, I watched the Cosby show. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna go potty? Let's go to the bathroom. You said there wasn't a bathroom. There, there is one, I just want you to meet people. Where is it? Is it, is it in it's, the hall? It's, it's in the hall. Let's okay, go, let's, let's go, go, to let's go, go. Let's go to the hall. Let's go to the Don't hall. Say anything, boy.